Hey guys, what's going on? It's you, Wanty. I got a brand new sneaker pickup coming in for you guys. Probably one of my favorite sneakers of the year. Real quick, this video is brought to you by privacy.com. I'm gonna get into that more towards the end of the video, so make sure you stick around. These shoes, the second they came out, I was like, ooh, I like those. Uh, however, I did get married this summer and also went on my honeymoon, so I was super busy, I was away. Therefore, when they dropped, I didn't know what date it was, and then by the time I was finally able to track them down, they were completely sold out. I think they were going for, well, under retail, just about on StockX, and then out of nowhere, they just kind of, I don't know if they got hyped up, but they shot up in price, so I did have to actually grab these on StockX for uh, over retail, which is crazy, but uh, they are the Nike SB Air Jordan 1 Low Quick Strike, the Eric Costins, Midnight Navy, Metallic Silver, retail was 110, but obviously they are the Jordan 1 Low, the Costins, and what I think they're most known for, or what people have been talking about, whether you like it or hate it, is that Jumpman right there on the toe box. To me, I just think that makes the shoe super unique. I really haven't seen that maybe, maybe ever from any type of Jordan or Nike sneaker, at least that I own. I don't have anything that's stitched on the toe box and I think it gives it such a unique look, such character. You've obviously got the metallic swoosh, which, you know, pops with that metallic silver and then, you know, the, the white hits and the navy hits. It's a pretty simple shoe, but the Jumpman on the toe box really sets it off. Quality on them, the suede's actually pretty soft, very nice. The leather quality is very average, that's the only thing lacking. It'd be awesome if these were like super, just the leather was a little bit better, but other than that, just a really cool shoe. And then on the inside, it does have Eric Costin's uh, signature uh, on the inside label, so another cool feature. The second I got them, I broke them right out. It was one of those shoes where I'm just like, I want these, these are my one of my favorite shoes of the year. Uh, wearability factors through the roof, um, and they're obviously, you know, they're they've gotten more hyped over the last few months. Jordan 1 Low is making like a super big, I don't know, comeback or resurgence. But when they're done this way, like the Nike SB version, I really like. I did grab the UNC Lows as well, but um, the the some of the Jordan 1 Lows, the quality just is really bad on them, so they're not wearable, whereas these quality is a little better. Um, the overall cut is a little bit different too, so it does come with white laces. I'll probably keep the navy in for now. I do want to talk more about privacy.com. This video is sponsored by them. Privacy.com lets you buy things online using virtual cards instead of real ones. And what this does is protect your identity and bank information on the internet. What I'm going to do is hop onto the website, show you how it works, buy some stuff using the card, just really great, especially for anyone that's nervous about using a credit card online. If your parents are nervous about using it, privacy.com is the way to go. All right, guys, so here is privacy.com. Here is where I'm going to get my virtual card that essentially protects my identity. That way, no one can hack my bank information or my identity, anything like that. You know, and as we, as sneakerheads, go on different sites we're unsure about, going through privacy.com is a smart option that way you can use one of these virtual cards to protect your identity and bank information best part is it is free so this is me using it right now very simple there's a little extension that way you can just click the little button there that you saw that little red button and then all of a sudden boom it loads in your privacy.com bank info so i was able to order a shirt instantly and then all that was just pulled from my privacy.com card now i'm going to go buy something else i have a whole nother card a whole nother number to use it's just so easy click that button right there and then boom i create the card and it loads all new information in so super easy to use super safe and it is free i am going to do a uh, five dollar giveaway to my viewers you just got to go to privacy.com backslash yo ante sign up now and you can go ahead and get that five dollars Definitely worth it. I'm going to show you right here. This is the page. It logs everything. It shows the card number that I just used, where I used it. So all that info is right there. Go check it out. Link in the description. All right, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Austin One Lowe's Midnight Navy, one of my favorite pickups of the year. I think that jumping in the toe box is 
super cool and I love it. I got a bunch of other sneakers that I just got to get around and make some videos on. So stay tuned for those. I do have, like I said, the UNC one uh, lows as well. So I'll bring those to you guys in a video and then make sure you guys check the link down below to privacy.com. Sign up, give it a try. Well worth it. As always guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Take care. Peace.